Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Might forget about it. First thing. Might forget about it. <laughs> Might forget about it. No, Shadow I, the Hedgehog. I, I feel really bad. Oh yeah, Shadow the Hedgehog is in this. Shadow the Hedgehog is in this. Hello there, my name is Maud Garrett, and joining me today we have the wonderful, the fantastic Hector Navarro. Hector, tell me about the shirt. You've always got something fun on. What's oh, that one? This is a Star Trek Lower Decks t shirt. Oh, that's great. Any chance oh. you can talk about Star Trek, this man will yep. find a way. That's right. Mm. I didn't include any Star Trek things on that's here. That's fine. I, I mean, you we probably. Can. You know what? We will. We're gonna th we're yeah. gonna we're gonna loop one in there because I'm thinking of one that I'm very excited about. Yes, for sure, for sure. Thank you for somewhat containing that excitement. Also, <laughs> Mr. Producer Extraordinaire, we have the Evan Yee here. Hello. Hello. Happy to be here. We love that one. We are coming to you from before the Chrissy holidays. Yeah. The festive season. But hey, 2023, heck of a year, wouldn't you say? Pretty oh, terrible, yeah. pretty awful all around. <laughs> okay, we're oh, we're not talking, talking about the real world? <laughs> yeah, not about, oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> movies, yeah, great movies. There were some fantastic movies before the whole entertainment world shut down for a moment there. We had Barbie Heimer. Did anyone else do the back to backs? No. The Barbie oh, I did it veins? within the same week, but not the same day. Wow. For sure. I yeah. did this, no, I actually had a. Mm. Well, I did the junket for Barbie, so I saw it before it came out. <laughs> I was trying to like. <laughs> oh. Imagine they did if like the junket for Barbie, and everyone like runs to the junket for Oppenheimer afterwards. That would have been yeah. incredible. That would have been great having two very different discussions. Or about. two hotel floors. One is all pink. The other one is all gray. Well, you saw what they did to the hotel for the junket. They yeah, decked in... out the entire floor of the Four Seasons in hotel. Pink. Incredible. Yes, like wallpaper, mm -hmm. um, yeah. photo stands for everything. They had the Corvette, the the pink um, oh, down yeah. in the parking area for you to like get photos with and nice. everything. Yeah, amazing. Anyway, that's the only thing I can bring to this conversation. So I'm glad I milked it. We also had Star Wars Rebels: Those Dreams Coming True into Real Life with Ahsoka and Loki. Yeah, season two. That was great. Oh my goodness, what a ride that was! But hey, what's coming up next year? 2024. <laughs> so much that, stuff. You said that's so sad. You're like, oh, oh no. Uh, I mean, I didn't think there was a ton of stuff coming out, and then I started putting this list together uh, for yeah. this tier list that we're going to do today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's actually there's a lot of stuff coming out next year. It's a good time to be a nerd. I mm -hmm. find myself saying that often. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's always a good time to be a nerd. You know? Now more than ever. Now more than ever. What are we going to call the year of 2024? We want more from 2024. You're welcome. Sure. Yeah. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, on the spot. Just thought of that one. So anyway, that magical list that Evan has put together, we are going to put it into a tier list to see what we are most excited about. This Great. is the tier list categories that we'll be playing with today. We've got bursting with excitement. Jesus, Maud. Uh, what, what, how, would you, <laughs> how else would you personify You're right. bursting with these? No, I Hector, I please show no, me. I can't wait to see your performances for the rest of these categories. Let's see it. <laughs> no, it was Next up. Okay, Next we've up. got so excited. Okay, yeah, good, 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 great, yeah. great. I'll Next. watch. I'll watch, okay, yeah. uh-huh. I might forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> and then, what is this again? <laughs> Incredible. Damn, you're good, Mod. Best of the biz. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Let's bring up that tier list. Let's All right. see. Let's go with okay. the, our first title. That's out there, our categories. Where will we be placing the Ooh. first one here? Deadpool 3. Oh, all right. Deadpool 3. Are we bursting with like an arm run? I mean, I gotta say, I'm bursting. I think. Then I, show me. I think I. <laughs> That's pretty good. I think I have to also put it in bursting with excitement. I mean, it's, it's the only MCU. Like movie, yeah. right? A bunch of stuff was pushed back because of the strikes and and rescheduling and everything. So yeah, and I am extremely excited to just see Deadpool three because Deadpool one and two are great. Great movies. So, yeah. yeah. And I, I, you know, I know that Ryan Reynolds is making a big uh, show about please stop spoiling the mm -hmm. movie. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of glad I saw some of the pictures because it's got mm. me bursting ah, with see. excitement. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I agree. I agree. Let's put it. Let's put it in bursting. Bursting with excitement. We don't. don't worry, we Ryan. don't need any more spoilers. Yeah. But yeah. the taste that we've had is delectable. <laughs> yeah. He was talking about us. He was talking about New Rockstar. He's like, please stop, New Rockstar. <laughs> yeah, yeah. like, okay. <laughs> so sure. Tweeting. We hear you. Yeah. Loud and clear. Yeah. Do you think we'll get any official, like any of the stuff that's been leaked? Do you think that now that it has been out, that Marvel and Disney will like 
in some press thing yeah. or in some trailer. Put it in a like, trailer, for sure, for sure. Yeah. I mean, they put yeah. Alfred Molina in the Spider-Man uh, No Way Home trailer. That's true. Yeah. Hello, yeah. Peter. That was the big deal for that. So, yeah, yeah. I think we're going to see uh, stuff revealed in trailers, but mm. then they're going to hold on to some other things. So, yeah. Fantastic. We've all just bursted already, and it's a couple of minutes into the video. <laughs> Next, we've got Agatha, the Dark Hole Diaries. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, this I'm, is my third coffee for the I, day. Yeah, is that yeah. obvious to everyone? It, I'm yeah. catching up. I'm catching up. It was Agatha all along. I, I am bursting with excitement for this one just based on the cast alone. The cast mm. is like pretty phenomenal. Yeah. And I love Katherine Hahn. Her yeah. her performance in, as that character was my favorite thing about WandaVision. Mm -hmm. And that was a great show and it was really emotional and everything. But Katherine Hahn stole it for me. So. Yeah. Like, so excited about this show. I was re-watching the episode where uh, the reality really starts breaking and mm -hmm. Catherine Hahn being like, oh, can we retake? Do Should you I do this again? That? Should yeah. I do this again? And you're like, so it's good. so unsettling. Mm. Yeah. She's yeah. so good. And the other thing I love about this is that it is not a one-to-one. -one, they're not just doing a comic book series or mm -hmm. character that's going to get a movie. They looked at everything they did and... The writer who was working on WandaVision kept pitching other stuff that they're, that's like in development. Right. But she kept including Agatha Harkness. And <laughs> Kevin Feige said, maybe we should just do an Agatha show. Yeah. Like, I you love, got you know. Hahn on contract. Yeah. You milk it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Back. That's I right. will say, though, I'm just so excited. Mm -hmm. Maybe even on the cusp of I'll Watch, only because so mm. much time has passed from WandaVision mm. that my um, Two years. excitement yeah. has kind of waned a little bit. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. I think that that was a little bit too long to continue that... The, the momentum. Uh, yeah. yeah. So what true. do we do in the case where we disagree? Do we go majority rules? Do we go, do we, I will we not do? hold back the Han. Please. No. Yeah, don't. Oh, you don't want to hold her back. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's, so, let's put, put her up in bursting. bursting? Yeah. Okay, because I just, could go either way on those okay. two. Yeah. But going so forward, excited. if two of us are like so excited and one of us is all watch, it goes into so excited. Is that kind of what we're... Yeah, we could do that. Right. Yeah, okay. yeah. majority Good. wins. This is That's gonna be why fun. there's you can try to, You can try to win someone over. I feel panel. like some alliances will be formed and friendships will be broken and during this episode, let's <laughs> let's let's continue. Good thing I've been building those allegiances before the That's show. That's right. Privately. I know, I'm shit out of luck here. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Evan. The next one. I don't, I don't even know you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the next one we have is Echo. 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 I am so excited I'm about so this. I'm so excited, yeah. I'm so excited about this one. I yeah. think Alakwa Cox is really fantastic. I think that she was like a get, like a, just a really interesting mm -hmm. new talent. And I want to yeah. see what they do with the show. I'm le I'm less excited about how people were like, it looks really dark and gritty. Mm. I don't care as much about that, but yeah. I want the this character to have have like a good story surrounding that character. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, it's cool that Kingpin is in this. Yeah, it's cool that Daredevil is in this. But I'm excited about the potential for. Echo, echo. Yeah, and I'm this. I'm interested in seeing what Marvel means by like this is going to be like our yeah. spotlight thing, more yeah. of our grounded yeah. type, you know, heroes or, yeah. or stuff like that. So I think it'll be really interesting, like first foray into into that. Well, we're both so excited, Mod. You're not so excited. Where are you? What are you? I'll watch. What are you? Might forget about it. Hit us with it. Go ahead. I like that it is leaning into a genre. I feel like Marvel, mm. um, having established so much, needs to really start like leaning into said genres. Like doing different things. Mm. Already forgot about it though, mm. didn't I? Mm. So you're at, a, you're at a might forget about it? Putting the no in echo. Oh my God. Buzzer. Okay, so then with know. that, does that drag it down to an all watch? Is that where I feel like echo? I feel very strongly about so excited though. Oh, oh you do? And then so oh. excited it up. So excited. <laughs> you know what, it, it, Dashiell, I would like to move the Echo to all watch, oh. if that's okay. Because I do sort of want to reflect, you know, maybe I'm a little in between all watch and so excited. Okay. But, but I'm definitely. But if he's so excited and I might forget about it, you're exactly right. That balance. Right. That yeah. Yeah. That's what okay. I'm trying to do. That's what I'm trying sure, to do. Sure, so sure. I'm, all, I'm happy with that. I'm okay with the that. The leftmost side of all watch once we add there more we things and all watch. There we go. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's on diplomacy. Okay. It yeah. was I like really it. well handled. I like it. Mm. Well, you know, I learned from Jean-Luc Picard. Master of Diplomacy. Okay, what's next? <laughs> X-Men 97. This is a this is an I'll watch for me. Yeah, I also feel that way too. Mm -hmm. I was scared of the X-Men growing up. What? I was scared. We need to unpack that immediately <laughs> now. Who was it in particular? I was scared was of- Was it Bishop? Was no. it the futuristic scenes with the Centurions? Ooh, was it Cable? Any future stuff freak you out? I think it was- Sentinels. Um, Sentinels. I think it was probably Beast? when I was really young. Yeah, Beast and Nightcrawler. And Wolverine. Beast was and my Nightcrawler. sexual awakening. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. You saw Kelsey Grammer. You're like, hello, Frasier. Just a smart blue hairy doctor. There we go. I get it. <laughs> I get it. 
<laughs> yeah, I had a, I had a, I had a like a like a man crush on Beast for sure too. I did. So Nightcrawler freaked you out because he was a demon. Not, uh, he's still Looked so cool. Like he's a such a complex, he's wonderful a character. Look like yeah, a demon. Hector actually demon. based an entire D and D character I that did. we did around I did. around oh, him. Oh, that's, that's cool. That's really cool. Yeah. I like Nightcrawler that. Nightcrawler yeah. from the Munich Circus. Yeah. <laughs> I am so excited for it. You're so excited, Evan. Where are you at? I mean, I think I'm at an I'll watch. Oh, okay. Where you yeah. at? I'll watch. I said I'll watch. <gasps> Absolutely, right. I'll this watch. Is, you know, we all only have... because my my defense is out of all of the different X Men things, my favorite was is not the '90s show. I know that people mm. love the '90s show, yeah. the cartoon. It's the best Rogue we ever had. It was the best Gambit we've ever had. There's some fantastic iterations of the characters in there. Oh, okay, great. We just added X Men '97. Yeah. But I think I was more of a. X Men Evolution guy. I think it was more of like the X Men comics. I think I was, yeah. you know, more of some of the eras of the films. But I'm really excited to see the. Um, I, I, maybe I am so excited. I don't know. I just want to see like those versions of the characters, but with updated animation yes. and writing. And yeah. I know that that's those two things are going to be great. So, like I still remember Becca. being like eight or nine years old and having the Magneto from the McDonald's um, oh, yeah. Happy Meal mm. box. Yeah, and like just being obsessed. It was such a big part of my wow. childhood. But so you're, are you are you bursting? You're, I could, no, uh, let's no put, I'm so excited. Okay. You're so excited. Let's let's put it left of Echo. Yeah, and I'll left watch. of Echo. Left yeah. of Echo. It is outranked Echo. Yeah. Wow. Okay. But we're still left honestly. I'll when watch. we I saw the teaser um, the other yeah. night and I, I was hyped. okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. Good. That's good. But you okay. were hot. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the next one. <laughs> Madam Web. What is this again? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah. That's where I'm at. I saw the trailer and I was just. I mean, she was with her, the father in the Amazon. Oh my gosh. I, I messed up the line. The it, it, the Amazon. And we're, I think to kind of define what the categories are too, like might forget about it is, oh, I really did. It's not a priority, but what is this again is a little lower than that. It's almost <laughs> yeah, like an yeah. insult. It's almost heard. like. It's not even on your no, radar. No, 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 no. It is on the radar, but I'm like. Oh. Actively avoiding. Got it. Yeah, I, right? I was going to forget do... about it. It's not a priority. What right. is this again? Is I'm going to actively, actively avoid, avoid it. it. Yeah, yeah. Because I was going to do like, oh, you know, I have a calendar event on my phone to yeah. watch or something. But like, I was like, ah, oh, it's too wordy. And also, mm -hmm. some of these are TV shows. Some of these are movie. Right. It's hard to like do that. So <laughs> that's I, kind of how we reason out on. I that. just want to put Madam Web at what is this again? You guys can put it anywhere you want. Ooh. Um, I, I kind of think I'd watch Might it on a plane. It? It needs sure. to be like oh, because I wouldn't pay money to see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But if uh -huh. I was locked in like a, a metal no, container PTK. in the air, for, yeah, it's yeah. a bit of a TPK. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. PTK. 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 Yeah. TPK. TPK is something That's totally different. That's a total kill. party kill. Total party kill. <laughs> Which um, also... I would say might forget about it, I think. Might forget about I it. I think if I... Okay, we'll put it in might forget about it. Yeah, I if mean... I wasn't covering it. Madam yeah. Webb. Sorry, Dakota Johnson. They're really pushing her, aren't they? Yeah. I mean, that's fine, but I just don't know if this is the vehicle for her. For I think she's a good actor. Do I just you don't think know if... that Madden Webb is going to be Sony's The Marvels? Uh, in what mm, way? Yeah, in what way? Say it. Having an all-female cast. And? Pushing it out for, for the women. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, I think that's what they're going to try to do. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Are you saying it like in a negative way well, yeah, or like in a positive Nana, way? Look where it's on the board. Well, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. But I would have put the Marvels at bursting with excitement. That's oh, what I would have done. Okay, okay. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good, yeah. good. Yeah, Maude, I don't like to judge movies based on just the gender of the people in it. Great. Mm -hmm. That's the point I was trying to make. <laughs> right, but like, that's wow, my stance. Does it suck to be a woman right now? No, it um, doesn't. It no, sucks to be Dakota. It does suck oh. to be a woman all the time, yeah, always. There it is. Yeah, that, that's absolutely true. The difference <laughs> is that I think that. Um, the track record here is just Sony. You yeah. could put a, you could put a Tom Hardy Venom up there. You could put a Jared Leto Morbius I still there. Seen the Venoms. You could put an PGK. Aaron Taylor Johnson oh. Craven, and I'm gonna put it at what is this again? You know. Um, yeah, yeah. And I and I've already promised uh, 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 me and my buddies that have a YouTube channel. We've already promised our audience like, look, if that movie comes out, Madam Web, and we talk about it, I will. If I'm dunking on it, I will be sure to equal opportunity dunk on all the the male led yeah, yeah. Sony movies that they made beforehand. Yeah, that's yeah. important. My to know. feminism shining through because I'm wearing the sweater. <laughs> there we go. I mean, Sony has done some great things with the female character. I do love the. Um, into yeah. Spider Verse. They're Spider phenomenal. Yeah. Great, Fantastic. phenomenal. Fantastic. Great, great, great. Yeah, great. something about the live action. It's not yeah. sticking. Yeah, yeah. yeah, they just are hiring the wrong live people. And they are milking the spiders. <laughs> they have to. Yeah, that's all they, they have to. Right. <laughs> Maybe they'll stick the landing one day. Uh, yeah. The next one that we have. 
DC, Creature Commandos. Creature Commandos. <laughs> uh, what is that again? Wow. I'm going to put it at, um, at uh, I'll Watch. Yeah, I'm I was going to say I'll the watch. same exact thing. Yeah. I think it's going to be Can really... Can you explain it to me? Because Might that forget just... about... I guess I guess that means with both yours and I's and mods, what is this again? And her not even knowing how to read the two lines in the teleprompter. I didn't know if it was Split or if Commandos was a separate show. This is an animated show. Mm -hmm. It is uh, from writer James Gunn. It's going to star uh, Frankenstein's monster, Bride of Frankenstein, mm -hmm. uh, a bunch of monster characters that are fighting in a in a Suicide Squad style unit. It's an yeah. obscure DC I comic. It's going to be animated. To do that. So it's animated. I trust yeah. I think I'm um, my my animated slot has already gone to. X -Men. Wow, you only have one. That's it. Mod. I don't watch, watch more anime. You know what? Cause... I think our alliance might be broken after this mod. I might be siding with Evan. He might be my new best friend. I put a few of my animated coins in the anime <laughs> box. <laughs> What does that even mean? Yeah, you put an animated yeah, box right. in an anime box? I, I've been watching more anime and that's oh, come with oh, the Oh, anime box. Okay, anime. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, DC... Not Aunt May or anything like that. <laughs> Creature, <laughs> Creature Commandos, if it's in there, it's going to go to... Um, uh, a watch. Might forget about it. Oh, might forget about, about it. Sorry about that one. No, okay. mm, no, I have no interest in Frankenstein's monster. Well, yeah, I mean... But I like yet, Gun. But, but I like I will Gun. say, I'm very interested in seeing how that... Out of everything James Gunn decided to use to like kick off yeah. his um, you yeah. know tenure over DC, it's going to be an animated show. Sure, but it makes sense because it's like a Suicide Squad type lineup, mm -hmm. right? You sold me. I'll watch. Mm. You can sell me on things. Okay. The la the last the last place, and I'll watch. We'll put it. We'll yeah. We'll put it's like to the right of Echo. Is there yeah. even a square for this? We're, yeah, there yeah, it is. Right there. No Future Commandos. Posters, I see it. I see it. I see it. Guys. Okay. Awesome. Right. Yeah. I think yeah. there's no logo yet either. All right. The next one is Skeleton Crew. Mm. This is a Star Wars show. I'm so excited. Jude I'm gonna Law's say. Jude gonna be in it. So excited for this one. Yeah. So excited. Kid friendly. Yeah. More mm -hmm. kid focused. I'm yeah. thinking yeah. it's like Space Goonies. Yeah, yeah. Probably. Yeah. yeah. So excited. Yeah. Yeah. And it's isn't it also the director of Spider Man? Oh, John yeah. Watts, yes. Yeah, John Watts yeah, yeah, is doing yeah. it. The, the three Tom Holland Spider-Man movies. It. Yeah. So it's going to have a good, good. Yeah, There we go. Skeleton Crew, done. Next. Fantastic. Yeah. Another Star Wars show, The Acolyte. This I'm bursting with excitement. Really? Interesting. I have read a ton of High Republic. Oh, okay. You yeah. and I read one High Republic we thing didn't love it. together. You yeah. didn't love it. No, we didn't. I <laughs> dug it and then kind of kept going. I did. I stopped. And I'm, oh. yep. And I'm very interested in, the cool thing for me is I'm reading High Republic books and comic books and things right now. And there's like a 13, 14, 15 year old Jedi knight mm. not a padawan a jedi knight she's very it. advanced her That's name is it? vernestra Rowe. she may have been she's in the that one? no oh. she has like she's a mary allen so she has green skin with purple hair Ooh. Oh. And she has a cool lightsaber that's also like a whip. Like it's this but but her whole thing is she's so young and she's trying to figure out how to get a handle on stuff mm -hmm. in this show there's like a 40 year old version of this character because it's that many years later. So, this is in the High Republic era. It is. Yeah, it's supposed uh, to be like the end of the, high, yeah, like tail yeah. end of the High Republic era. And I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if that means it's going to like end in a big bad way. Yeah. Very excited that it's just like a, a 40 year old uh, version of this character. Like an actress is playing this little girl character but grown up. Oh, yeah. Because I just want to yeah. see, you know, them, tem them take what they've established. And it's like, you knew her when she was a kid figuring stuff out. Now here she is, maybe a little jaded and cynical and you know yeah so i'm so excited but or, but you guys can put or i'm bursting with excitement but we can do so excited for this I'm or so excited. i'll watch or whatever yeah i'm just a little nervous i'm nervous mm. for the show i'm like does it expand the world i mean uh, is it gonna be too much is it gonna be too much lore yeah, like you know exposition city. star wars is already too much lore well yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> already right now it's already too much lore yeah 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 so excited all right, okay. so excited. So excited. I'm more excited yeah. for Skeleton Crew. That's fine. We can put it yeah. to the right of Skeleton Crew. To the right crew. of Skeleton Crew. The Acolyte, there it is. You still sold it very well. Yeah. I Thank like you. The, the signage. Yeah. The, oh, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. The logo. The logo. The logo. Yeah. looks cool. It looks and it's going to be, a, the actual story is going to be about like a murder mystery and like, so that, and yeah, that stuff mm. seems cool. Okay. I'm very excited about it. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. The Halo. Halo TV series. <laughs> Season two. Did anyone watch Halo? Nope. Not yet. It's I played on my, it. It's on my to-do list, so this one for me is a might forget about it. Yeah. I mean, I was, I'd was i hazard to say, what is this again? But oh. I might be bitter because I was terrible at Halo as a kid. Oh. I was so bad I at Halo. I would have kicked You probably you. did. Yeah. What a sad childhood. Terrible at Halo, scared of X-Men. <laughs> You're telling me. Evan. All I had was Pokemon. <gasps> my goodness. Oh, I mean, I love Pokemon. <laughs> Are you still playing Pokemon Go? No, not Pokemon Go, unfortunately. Neither. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> uh, All right. Wait, what are we, where are Mod, we putting it? I might forget about it. 
I'm going to say my favorite. This is season two, okay. right? Season I haven't two. seen yes. season one. Yeah. And yeah. it's so interesting because it's got such a huge fan base. Like, right. this really should yeah. be going up against, like, Fallout, The Last of Us, but the, the marketing. Yeah, let's put it, it to the right, Dash. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. The Thanks. marketing Thanks, has been lackluster sure. for this show. And I've sure. also heard that they've gone more into we're going to be inspired by Halo. As opposed to uh, I see. Really, I yeah, I mean it is a video game, but there's there is still a storyline right yeah. there. Yeah, that's uh, Halo's a weird one because it has such a die-hard fan base mm -hmm. that if the, if you deviate even a little bit, I saw people commenting on a trailer for season two or something, and they were like, first shot of the trailer, we see Master Chief with his helmet off. Like they're so yeah, they mad about that. Off. They're so yeah. mad, and I'm just like, oh. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, because if you. Oh, that I'm doesn't doing seem it myself. fun. I'm doing that doesn't seem fun. I don't know if I want to d dive into that. Yeah. That doesn't seem fun. You guys don't seem cool. <laughs> yeah, You're don't mad want about to participate that? in this. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll watch Madam Webb instead. <laughs> Might be nicer. For the second time, yeah. Let's Madam just Webb ignore the fact that I immediately had a very visceral reaction just to you saying that, and I became yeah, I the thing that you hated. Uh, okay. You did? Because, you, but are you a big Halo person? I'm not. I'm not a big Halo person. Even I know that you don't mess with that. I know. Mm. I know. <laughs> and I've got a few thoughts that are in that line coming up, by the way. But the next one we're going to talk about is True Detective, Night County. Night County or Night Country? Night. Did Let's I type it, it wrong? Let's, Let's see. look it up. Night County. Either one, Let's I guess. See. Sounds. Combine them. Night, Night County. It is I feel Night like Country. Night Country sounds yeah. better. It is Country. Um, Night Country. This one is a. Might forget about it, but it's not a reflection on what I think. I'm. Sh I know that the show's fantastic. I haven't seen one season of it yet. I'm exactly the same boat right. as you. I've heard nothing but amazing things. I'm sure it's great. Mm -hmm. One of these days, I'm going to sit down yep. and buckle in and watch them all. But I can't stop watching Fargo instead. See, same with. I've only seen one season of Fargo. Great show, but mm -hmm. uh, but I'm like, oh, I need to. I. Uh, there's so many great TV shows like that. You're gonna be in yeah. the mood. That yeah, and uh, it's yeah. So this one yeah, is just. An, I might true. forget about it for me. Left of Madam Web. But yeah. you guys can left of Madam no, Web. Let's do that. Let's see left of Madam Web. Okay. This is very funny because normally I'm usually one who hasn't seen True Detective, uh, uh -huh. and I was just relying on guessing that oh, you guys right have seen True No, Detective. you haven't seen it yet. Okay. Nope. From what I understand <laughs> about it, the first season will remain the best season, and yeah. every single yeah. other season is trying to encapsulate. That was the one with McConaughey, that, right? Sure was. Sure. Yeah. Woody Harrelson, and then uh, I think they moved into like Colin Farrell sure, and Ad uh, Rachel mm -hmm. Adam. McAdams? Mahershal Ali was in one of them, wasn't he? Oh, I want to see that season. Yeah. Season, season three, three. Yeah. yeah. See, the show's going to be fantastic. Season three, I think, is kind of where it started coming back. But yeah. For all our TD fans yeah. out there, yeah. you know, we're so, sorry we're letting you down yeah. here. There's just okay. a lot of, well, there's a lot to watch. Lots, Sometimes you just have to pee to K. <laughs> the next one we have, this is controversial, and I would love to talk about this. Mm -hmm. okay. Avatar The Last Airbender, Netflix edition. I'll watch. Edition. I'll watch. The live action Avatar. <sighs> I'll watch. That's where I'm at. Okay, where did you land on that and why? Uh, I am not bursting with excitement, and I am uh, hesitant to be so excited because the creators did sort of walk away they from the show. They failed on it. Mm -hmm. And secondly, just because, not that it's the same people at all, it's completely different people, but I've seen live action Last Airbender. It mm -hmm. doesn't have a great track record. I tried the, to the leave. The Shyamalan film was really, really bad. I, I watched it on a plane, and I tried you to tried walk, walk out. out. <laughs> I watched it in the theater in 3D, Mott. <laughs> it's the worst oh, no! 3D I think I've ever, it was bad, because they did it in like two weeks or something. It's not real. Oh. It's not real 3D. I mean, there's also, that was there. the heyday of 3D conversion, too. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but having said that, I really like some things about this show, some of the casting I think is really great. Oh, yeah. The casting is right? amazing. Yeah. And they've even got the, the voice actor who plays the cabbage salesman oh. is playing the cabbage. Like, <laughs> so those kinds of, I'm like, I absolutely do believe that the people who are working on the show, they do love it. Mm -hmm. It's hard not to love Avatar The it's Last Airbender. It's also hard not to listen to the yes. original creators saying we can yeah. no longer align ourselves with this project. Yeah. So, and they've actually spawned their own, like they're making their own great. production yeah. company to do it the right way. So that's so a, this that's, is feeling like a place setter. Right. And that's what? another reason I'm not like mad that this show is coming out mm -hmm. because it is just like, it's just going to whet our appetites. And then Avatar Studios, which is going to be animated projects, movies, TV shows, they're coming out over the next rest of our lives. Yeah. So like, so, you know, I'm going to, I'm mad. I'll watch. I'm still so excited. Oh, okay, great. That's I love great. Avatar The Last Bender as a series yeah. so intrinsically. So I was on Nickelodeon in Australia from 2006 yeah. to 2009, which is when Avatar was releasing so as an animated Aang. series. So you met Aang. You know Aang. I, I went to the animated <laughs> studios in Burbank. Like, it was a huge oh, wow. thing. But yeah. I, I, this was like my... I, I was so into this show. Mm -hmm. um, and I think growing up with it, it it's just like yeah. I will every couple of years do a rewatch. And it's every single great. time, yeah. and like, it's great. I'm blessed 
that I get to watch this. Mm -hmm. like, it is such a great time to be alive. So, so, so excited. Where even, are you at, Evan? Yeah, I mean, I think it's one of those things where, like, I really want to give uh, the live action adaptations of, like, animated shows, especially, like, anime, a chance. I remember starting the Netflix adaptation of Cowboy Bebop and being, like, really Ooh, disappointed. Yeah. Um, yeah. This show, I've heard, you know, some behind-the-scenes things about, like, it being different from the main story, but you know, mm -hmm. with um, Netflix's Scott Pilgrim, they took a different swing, and you know, I think it worked in some aspects where it didn't, didn't work like in this others. Much. I saw uh, your rating. I gave it three. That's three stars. Good. That's an all watch. But the movie was five. Yeah. So that's a two point difference. Yeah, that is oh, a two point difference. You know, that's a 60% to 100%. Dang, 100%, yeah. Dang Mon, calling me out on my letterbox <laughs> reviews. Dang. I pay attention. Dang, nicely done. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think I think um, for me, this is like an I'll watch. So maybe. All right, that's two I watch, I'll watch in one. So excited. It's the left, the most left. Yeah, oh, no. maybe. No, after X Men? After X Men. Want? Okay. After X Men? Is that okay? okay? Oh, yeah. I know that it, you there know, we go. troubled you. Oh, yeah. Is yeah. that cool? I'm good with that. What great. do you want it? Left of X-Men? What do you want? I'm happy with that. Okay, great. <laughs> okay, the next one we've got. Oh. I am really <laughs> with excitement for this one. It is Dune Part 2. Yes. Dune. Or as uh, Australians say, June. June. I know, I have to, I have to like, I have to correct myself now so people know what I'm talking about. June Part 2. June Part 2. I am, June. I am also bursting with excitement for this bursting one. Bursting with yeah. excitement. Let's go. Bursting with excitement. <laughs> That's Everything. the number one spot. Are we... Are we is it number debunking one? Debunking Deadpool I, I, 3? I'll debunk a Deadpool. <gasps> Whoa. Well, okay, I don't know about that. No? Okay, go ahead. You want to put it after Deadpool? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's just put okay. it in between the Marvel yeah. projects. Yeah. <laughs> Do yep. Part 2. Let's Great. So go. we all watched Great. the first movie. Yeah. yeah. We thought it, it was fantastic. It rules. Yeah. I, yeah. I love this movie. Yeah. I've never heard you of this it was next. Better than the book. Yeah, it is better than the book. I've never heard of this next thing. <laughs> what is this? Raymond's big movie. So I was looking at a list of movies that are coming out next year, and apparently the video game character Rayman Rayman. No. has a movie coming out. I it's, didn't even play it. It's that. a Sony movie. Uh, it's coming out next fall. Sony Animation? Sony Animation. <gasps> they did Spider Verse. They also did. Sonic? Everything else that's bad. Angry Birds. Angry Birds. Uh, I had yeah, to do the junket right. for that one. The, the emoji movie. That's Sony oh, as well. Oh boy. So, <laughs> I mean, I I was a Nintendo loyalist growing up, uh -huh. so I was really kind of into the Nintendo properties. So you don't like the Rayman? Sony properties. I don't think I've ever played Well, you a know Rayman that Rayman game. eventually crossed over with Mario. What, they had their little glove off? They both no, wear white gloves, well, I Yeah, like uh, Rayman's Raving Rabbids. Oh, Sonic, yeah! Sonic also yeah. wears white yeah. gloves. What, yeah. are they, what are they, like forensic scientists or something? Well, I, that's what I thought too. And then I went to Japan, everybody has white gloves on. Oh, it's crazy. Oh, there you go. I just it's got crazy. an immediate answer. That's it's crazy. so cool. Yeah. No, I'm kind of making a joke, but in all seriousness, like people who have like regular jobs there, yeah. like people who are like working on the train because they're like train conductors or, you know, people uh, that come yeah, through and yeah, check, yeah. like everybody just has like white gloves. Yeah. Makes absolute Like sense. custodians, like, yeah. it's like th that kind of work. So I'm like, oh, Mario Plummer. Yeah. Makes uh, sense. Yeah. yeah. Sign of the Hedgehog. He's Makes like burrowing through hedges. He's like, that's it. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Yeah. Uh, look, what's this again? I'm going to go, what is this again? Yeah, what is this again? Yeah. Boom. Sorry, Raymond. Sorry, Rayman. I guess everybody doesn't love you. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? Yes, everybody uh, okay. loves Rayman. <laughs> All right, before we get to the rest of it, make sure you check out nerdride.shop for a ton of great merch to celebrate the holiday season. We know it's past, but hey, you never know uh, what you might need. We got the Best Bub shirt. We've got the Christmas Story shirt. It's a Iron Man leg lamp, and we got this other holiday shirt here. And also, we've got a cool mug. Dash, oh, let's pull up the mug. Oh no, we got it here. Is that it? Uh, we got an even cooler oh, mug. Oh, I'm sorry. An even cooler one? Uh, yeah, so this mug is inspired by the Loki Goddess Stories Ascension. Cool. Uh, and, and besides a mug, we also have it as a rug and like a keyboard mat. So check out nerdride.shop. Um, it's the best way to support the break room. And uh, we'll have a bunch of cool stuff coming up. And if you want to see some merch or you have ideas for things you want, uh, you want to see in the store, just leave a comment below. I can just picture somebody with the t-shirt, with the keyboard, they hold up a mug. They're they're in a chair at their computer on a rug, all Loki'd out, oh, wow. and they're just like dun 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 dun, yes. hrum, hrum, dun 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 dun, and they're just like finally. <laughs> I don't know. I don't you know two can do. claim your throne like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Next movie. Da -da 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 -da. What do we think of Ghostbusters? I'll watch. Dude, I'm gonna forget about it. I'll watch. Ooh, I forgot about Mud. it. Um, uh, I actually didn't mind the one that came out. I didn't. Yeah. I didn't hate it. So I'll watch Afterlife? it. Afterlife. Yeah. I'm in an I'll watch. I'm in an I'll watch. Let's put I'll watch. Do you want to go to the right of Creature Commandos? I do. Yeah. I do. There we go. Thank Far you. right. I just want to say is. I want to shout out that there's a kid named Podcast in that series. Yeah. That's really funny to me. Yeah. But I was scared of Ghostbusters growing up. 
You were scared of I ghosts? Mean, that that makes it, sense. Like, okay. The <laughs> Ghostbusters 2 with that guy coming out of the picture frame. Oh, yeah. I was just like, no, thank the you. The Ghostbusters 1 with that BJ ghost? No, thank no, you. No, Don't you. come into my room at night mm -hmm. try to give me a BJ. <laughs> I say no. No. Jeez. You don't want that Too ghost, cold. though. Really inappropriate. Too cold. Too yeah. Cold. Ectoplasm? Yeah. On my wiener? No thanks. <laughs> anyway, we've got the next one. It's Frozen okay. Empire. Nope, that's also Ghostbusters. <laughs> that's Frozen Empire, Ghostbusters. It's Ghostbusters <laughs> Frozen Empire. It's Godzilla Ghostbusters. Kong, New Empire. That's, that's the next oh, episode. The next there's one. two empires back to back. Godzilla, so Godzilla Kong. Kong. Three, two, one. <laughs> you left me here. You left me here. You left me here. Right. We can set it up. Uh, I'm not going to do that. No, I'm not doing it. That's okay. I will every time. Uh, I'm so excited. I am at, Ooh, a, I'm at, an, at an I'll watch. I'm yeah. so excited I'll watch. You know what? Uh, maybe I'm at a so excited. It's, it's Kong and it's Godzilla. And that trailer was ridiculous. That trailer was ridiculous. Oh, I'm on the How? cusp. How many toys are they going to sell in Mini Kong? Is uh, that going to be is Mini oh, Kong the, the new baby, baby Yoda? Yeah, yeah, maybe. Yeah, 100%. Maybe. I'll watch. All right. I'll watch. I'll watch. I'll watch. Yeah. I'll watch. Okay. But I will watch it... it before or after Echo. Yeah. Yeah. Before right Echo. Yeah, before yeah. Echo. Yeah. Right that feels there. Good. Right there. That feels good. So we're more excited about. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Yeah. Feels that's good. All right. That. Next up, Kung Fu Panda Four. Trailer just came out today. That's yep. how. That's where we're dating the episode. Jack so. Black is doing the Figure music it for it, I believe. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yep, he's already been working on it. Like the music for it? Yeah, he's going to be doing songs, I think, for Kung Fu Panda oh. 4. Oh, wow. I thought, yeah. I think, and I and voicing it? He did I do, think he's he did working do a, on he it. He did do a cover of Everybody Was Kung Fu Fighting for the first film in 2008. <laughs> so maybe we'll get another no, Peaches, that, Peaches, 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 Peaches in 2008? Yep. Dang. What were you, four years old? That's exactly right. Thank you for the math. You were one of those kids, those adorable kids yeah, that was like, can hey, you talk to us about the movie? Yeah, and Jack Black was like, oh, hey, little guys. He actually yeah. gave us the best Nickelodeon <laughs> promo. Oh, yeah. For years. Oh, that's great. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. We're watching Nickelodeon with Maude Garrett no, and Jack like, Black. No, he did like a Peaches, but for Nickelodeon. Oh, he was like, Nick, 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 Nickelodeon. Oh, yeah. great. Wow. Kung Fu Panda, I'm so excited about this. I saw the trailer. Yeah. Uh, I'm so excited. I didn't watch it today. Kung Fu Pandas 1, 2, and 3 are pretty solid. Yeah, I think I they're remember, all great. Angela I, I like is no longer in it, is she? I don't think that the, no. that the warriors, the legendary warriors are in it. So that's Seth Rogen, mm. David Cross, Angelina Jolie, Jack, Jackie, Chan. Jackie Chan. I don't yeah. think they're in it. Mm. But I don't want to say who's in it if y'all haven't seen the trailer. Um, yeah. But uh, you know what? I'll just spoil it. They're bringing back Ian McShane, who played Tai Lung in the first film. Who's oh. Ian McShane. The... He's in it. Oh. I did see, yeah, yeah, I saw the, yeah. the image. I yeah. Like image. Yeah, he's pretty fantastic. I think it's gonna so. be fun. I mean, I think DreamWorks is finding like um, kind of like a new new stride for themselves right now. I mean, after Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots know? was awesome. Yeah. I haven't seen uh, Ruby Gilman Teenage Kraken, but I heard it was good. Oh, but I haven't oh seen that it. looks yeah, yeah, yeah. But then, terrible. But then Trolls that didn't look good. Uh, that's that's, that's DreamWorks. Yeah. So I'm gonna say so excited, but you guys can put it at all watch. I'm more excited about this, Kung Fu Panda 4, than X-Men 97, but I'm probably Whoa. less excited than uh, Acolyte. That's where I'm at. Oh, that, no. No, what do you, okay, where do y'all want to put it? Go ahead. I think, I think you before, tell me. before Airbender? After, no, Air, no, after, after. Airbender? After yeah. Airbender? Yes. Be before Godzilla Kong. <laughs> yeah, better be yes. before Godzilla Kong. <laughs> okay, all right, we'll do that all right. One. I have a good feeling about it. Maybe yeah. I'll be wrong, but we'll see. Okay. All right, so the Fallout show. Yeah. Ooh, uh, I'll best. watch. Bursting? 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 I mean, I played oh the video God. game. Oh, that's oh, okay. right. We were talking about that the other day. Where are you at? I have no relationship with the Fallout franchise. I right. think this is no. going to take on, and I'm. this is the, can I just rant for a yeah, second as, as the gamer of the panel? Go ahead. We are, we've spent decades being the laughing stock where um, video games were made into film and TV. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Like Street Fighter, yep. Mortal Kombat. It's yep. just like, do not do it. The original Mario, Super Mario Bros. Awful. movie. Yeah. Awful. Like, you just, you weren't supposed to do it right. We are crushing this is our time yeah the last of us so good mm -hmm. fallout i have a feeling it's going to be so good okay the, even though it was an animated but like you know the fact that they brought the super mario brothers movie billion dollars yeah, yeah. you know yeah. so it's yeah. like true. i think we're fine we can forget about the assassin's creed with michael fassbender but we're coming Ooh. into our own now which is great okay so and um jake gyllenhaal was um prince of persia prince of persia yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that good what? or bad? Are That's you... so bad. Okay, good. Okay, good. Okay, okay. So <laughs> we can Jake ignore Gyllenhaal that. Jake Gyllenhaal looks like he's from a place called Persia. Not Persia. at all. There it Not is. at all. <laughs> there it is. So, okay. So then I will give you, you want to put it in all watch, but to the left of X-Men 97, like the most all watch thing. Okay. 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 Fallout. Oh, that's a good compromise. I'll watch mm. all the way to the left. That's a good compromise. I, I think it's going to be great. It, it I think does, it's going to give it does, Mandalorian. It does look good. Yeah. It does look like really, really good. It's post apocalyptic and it's going to be fun. And funny. It yes. looks funny. Yeah, yes. it did look funny. Yeah. Very really sense of humor in the trailer. Okay. Yeah. 
Rebel okay. Moon Part 2. We don't have to wait very long for this one. Yeah. Oh, but that's oh really well, Part 1's right? coming out around. Part 1 will have will be out by the time this video comes out. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Um, so we have to uh, we have to assume what the world will think and then mm. see how excited we will be. Yeah, when is part two movie. coming out? You said not. This will come out in April, I believe. Oh, I'll watch it. If it's going to be straight to Netflix. Oh, yeah, that's true. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah. You know, that um, actually is a little... I might, might forget about it only because I just haven't seen the first one yet at this point. Yeah. I, I, I'm not really... It's chunky sci-fi. Sure. I'm not prioritizing it. And it looks cool, but it's also like y'all remember Jupiter Ascending? Yeah. The you know what? Even even um, the creator that kind of came out that fell under the radar the entire time. Some mm -hmm. of this really hard sci-fi stuff is mm -hmm. just not sticking with the yeah. movie. It's, it's either yeah. or, it's either or, Dune level, right? Or, it, or the adaptation just doesn't do it justice. But this is yeah. like an, this isn't an adaptation. This is a, an original thing, right? And that's but what I'm, I'm still, wondering because yeah. a lot of the original yeah. stuff without a pre-existing fan base hasn't been doing as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Those that have, you know, some. A little worried about sci-fi as a genre at the moment. Yeah, yeah. But fantasy has also been taking a hit a little bit with like the Wheel of Time and the that's true. Lord of yeah. Rings shows. What is the Shadow and Bone? What is that? Got the axe. Yeah. I loved that. The books what? were so good. Read Six of Crows, everyone. What's the blue thing left of, of uh, Madam Web in uh, uh, True Detective? Oh. True Detective. Thank yeah. you. I would put Rebel Moon over True Detective. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. Might, yeah, but might it didn't lead a might forget about it category. Yeah. No, after no? Ghostbusters. Oh, but if you're or both, after like, Ghost, yeah, you both might forget about it. Again, it's just not a priority. Yeah, for me not at a this priority time. right at this now. Then it's before yeah. True Detective. Before yeah. True, because I feel like Rebel Moon less of an investment for me to honestly to watch than True Detective, which is seasons of yeah. TV that I want to <laughs> yeah. catch up on. True. I want to watch it all. Yeah, True Detective. All right. Um, now we're going into stuntman territory. Yeah, the fall Mr. guy. Mr. Ken himself, the fall guy. Dude, Not to be confused with Fall Guys, the video game. Right. I yeah. just saw this trailer today for the first time because we were doing this. It looks really good. Yeah. I'm, very, I'm, 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 I'm so excited about this. Yeah. I'm so excited. <laughs> it looks sexy, dare I say. Yeah, it looks I'm, fun. We need more like mm -hmm. action comedies that are mm -hmm. in like in that vein too. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah, so, I think those two have got great chemistry. I'm going to say so excited yeah. to the right of my Star Warses, but I'm going to go sure. to the theater to see this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. what I like it. Think? Good? That's yeah. good. There you go. There you go. Okay. Apparently drink if I mention anything Australian. So okay. drink up there MS. We go. There yeah, Because it's Furiosa in the Mad Max saga. Dude. I mean, this Mate. is, a, this is a bursting or so excited. It's up there. It's oh. got to be up there. What are you at? Not a fan? You don't like Mad Max? Two Australians. Okay, I'm going to be real with you guys. I, okay. I liked the premise. I mean, not, I, I didn't like the premise. I liked the the heart of yeah. what Mad Fury Max Road. was. With Fu yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. But the premise, yeah. they drove, yeah. they turned around, yeah. and they drove back. Oh, back. interesting. <laughs> uh, Mod, Lord of the Rings, they get the ring, they walk, they throw it, they walk back. But there are elves <laughs> and swordsmen. <laughs> No, I mean, it yeah, is. It's, cars. It's, it's an epic quest. It's an odyssey. It's a journey. I thought you were going to say that you didn't like the premise because, like, the movie stresses you out. It's full of, like, mutants. Yelling. It's full, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like, Silver you know. Silver spray. Yeah, all that. It's, it, 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 does, it does. It's like it has a, it makes me have a visceral reaction. <sighs> it's not my favorite franchise, but damn it, if Fury Road isn't like a, it's a powerhouse of a movie. It's yeah. Just, I'm on the, I mean, you know, to support. Um, yeah. you Aussies. Know. Yep. Have to. I'm, I'm so excited. You're so excited? I don't know. I don't uh, really buy it. I'll watch because I'm excited. <laughs> Do we? Uh, I, I'll put it. It's so excited. You want to put sure. it to the left of Star Wars? No. It's the first thing. So excited. I mean, I want. Oh, I want both coming oh, from bursting. bursting. We're oh, okay. compromising. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're compromising Great. here. So Dashiell, yeah. that's going to go so excited. There it is. There Great. it is. There Great. it is. I mean, I was so excited. So majority okay. rules. It's actually behind Agatha. Pop it up. You want to? Okay. You want to put it bursting yep. to the right of Agatha? There were two burstings on the panel. Okay. Who am I to okay. yuck your yum? Okay. I'll take that. I'll take that. All right. This next one. I don't even want to say it. The Garfield movie. I'm bursting. What is what? this? <laughs> You're not. Uh, bursting full of lasagna. Yeah. <laughs> I saw the trailer for it's this one. not even a Monday. Because I was like, trailer can't be that bad. And then I watched it and I was just like so... First of all, it, it. I feel bad because when Chris Pratt was announced as the voice of Mario, people were dunking on him. Yeah. And I was like, well, hang on. Well, let's see what he... And then I wasn't that impressed with it. Mm -hmm. No, I this... think he got outacted by so many others in yeah. that class. Yeah. And then this comes out, this trailer, and I'm like, it just sounds like a him. It's a, it's, it's a sound, <laughs> same thing, right? Versus yeah. people are talking right now about Robert Pattinson. Because yes. he did a voice oh, in yeah. the Studio Ghibli movie. So and good. he's like, he went ham. Yeah. yeah. And I'm like... 
that. You're gonna. You yeah. should do that. Celebrity. I don't want to know. I don't want to be able to identify. Exactly. Which exactly. is why, actually, yeah. in the Super Mario Brothers, yeah. um, was it Keegan Michael Key? Yeah, who as played Toad. Toad. Great job. Yeah. Could not tell it was him. Great mm -hmm. job. He was Great fantastic job. Great job. as that character. Anya Taylor Joy was Peach. Oh, Terrible. Yeah. Just fine. Terrible. And there then, was a line where she said, "Here we go." Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, as a critical <laughs> Peach player in uh -huh, Mario Kart uh -huh. 64 You're like, for 15 years, wasn't Peach enough? Yeah. Right. Right. She's like, and here we go. And right. I was like, yeah. Nah. And then, okay, of course, just need a little the, bit of a here the, we go. The MVP of that film was JB, Jack Black. Yeah. Yes. Oh, a thousand percent. Because yes. it, was, the it was him, but I it was also Charlie like. Day is, Luigi was great too. Oh, yeah. yeah that's he a good was good. Point. So, yeah. anyway, Garfield looks like crap. So, yes. we're going to put it at. <laughs> what, what is this again? again? I feel bad. I don't. Yeah, put it there. Put him out and left Garfield. Samuel L. Jackson is playing Garfield's biological cat father. Oh my who, God. Come, who comes back? I mean, he already has the cat. I don't. In yeah, like Carol Danvers' cat, you know, like he already oh, had right, that right, cat right. thing. And also that story, going back to Kung Fu Panda, Kung Fu Panda did it. Like Kung Fu Panda, you know, when Poe Panda met his own biological father, and he's voiced by Brian Cranston. Oh. That was a gr that was in Kung Fu Panda yeah. Three. That was great. Yeah, so this really just looks, this yeah, looks not a little great. derivative maybe. All right, the next yeah. one, Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. Ooh, you've What's always loved these. Bursting with excitement. For I this have one. never been into this franchise. <gasps> and yeah. you've seen the three yeah. new ones, like the trilogy. You've seen them. I've seen the. I'm um, when Which James one? Franco was in it. Oh, uh, <laughs> and you didn't see the two after that. Bowed out after that. That's one. your mistake because uh, that one with James Franco, I think, is just fine. Like I think it's yeah. good. There are moments in it that I think are good. Mm -hmm. Andy Circus as the ape. Mod, here's it's the just, deal. It's just Mod, not right. hang on, yeah. hang on. Mm -hmm. I have Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, War for the Planet <laughs> of the Apes in 3D. We're gonna come over. We're gonna watch them, and I get, and I promise you, they are an absolute step up. There's no James Franco in it. He dies oh. in between the two movies. Oh. Spoilers. Yeah, is that yeah. an SA accusation that happened? In I don't think time? so. Okay. I don't think so. I think it really was like, we just want to, like, you know, oh, like yeah, you have yeah. years pass in the story, and then, like, there's a human plague, so they're mm -hmm. like, what are the uh, odds that James Franco's uh, human lives? Yeah. So they decided to come and up. And so this movie will be following A continuation, but okay. it looks like years and years and yeah, years from now. Yeah. Bursting. Yeah. I'm I, bursting. For me, I'm, I'm looking at an I'll watch. Yeah. I'll watch? What are you at? You're at a, you're at a, what is this again? I'm a might forget about it. You might forget about it? This, you guys are killing me. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But, okay. but the compromise is you get to select where we put it in the I'll watch. All the way to the left. Right. Above Fallout. It's got to go above Fallout. Okay. This, I, I think and, so, yeah. Let me tell you, just based off of just the trailer for this movie alone, I think the visuals do look gorgeous. And the thing I do yeah. love about this franchise, and especially the last two, not the Franco one, but it, there were elements of that in that one, is that it does feel like they're tr they really give, they give a shit. Like they're mm. trying to do a real emotional kind of a, it's still blockbuster popcorn entertainment, yeah. but it feels like they're trying to do something different. And this yeah. looks like the story is gonna try to go to that soulful place. Okay. I so, think so, yeah, it does feel very emotional. We'll yeah. watch the two that you haven't seen yet. I can't wait. I promise you they're freaking good. And then also, quick question, have you seen the original from 1968? With Charlton Heston, I know. The yes, of the Apes. You've I, seen well, it. Okay. I haven't seen it. Seen it, but I know. Oh, I know you got it. You got like. to do that one for sure because yeah. it's in pop culture. But yeah. that is a movie that I will say, even despite everything we know about it from popular mm -hmm. culture, we were all raised on The Simpsons that yes. has parodied it, spoofed yeah. it, whatever. You can still go back and watch that movie, and it's terrifying, mm. and it is effective, and it's a uh, uh, a banger. It's really, mm. really good, and did it's really I smart not, and funny. And did yeah. I not sell Fallout in that same way to you guys? Is um, that what's happening? Yeah, is but it, um, you know, okay, that's, okay. Uh, you that's why I like the trailer that's, for this one more than that's, Fallout. That's sorry. why they're right next to each other. That's why they are right next to each other. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. The next one, House of the Dragon season two bursting. I might forget about it. <laughs> yeah. Might forget about it. Yeah, no, yeah. You might forget about it? Yeah, Besting. listen, I don't give a scrank about Game of Thrones. Have you seen any of it? Nope. Season okay. one was amazing. <laughs> Season one, I saw Season it. Season one was so, yeah. I House really dug it. Oh my God. I, I mean, I did see House of the Dragon one. Season one. Yeah. You did? you did? Okay. And the acting was top tier. Mm -hmm. Stella. And yeah. the story was um, uh frustrating and hard to watch because yeah, of, yeah, because of exactly all of the yeah. betrayal and all of the, yeah. you know. No. Yeah, yeah, Just send each other a cupcake and be done with it, you know? Like, Honestly. Yeah. Damn it, being adults. And it was chock full of incest, just like all the Game of Thrones fans <laughs> love. I mean, they had incest out the wazoo and back in the wazoo, it, you know it, what I'm saying? It is usually only the Targaryen lineage. <laughs> not yeah. not anymore, that. now it's everybody. But then Everyone. it was King's Landing, yeah, oh, the yeah. Lannisters as well. So you're bursting with excitement for this the one, and both Evan and I are at Might Forget About It. I think that's gonna put it at an all watch. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Where in all watch do we want to put this? I don't get a say anymore. You want to? Yeah, of course you do. No, I, I mean, I'm bursting, but uh -huh. there's some great stuff happening now in all watch. Nan, mm. you're up. Uh, mm. uh, uh, mm. yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. question for you. Are you more, you're more excited than for, than for Fallout? No. You're more excited for Game of Thrones or Fallout? Oh, they're pretty neck and neck for me. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So either to the right or either to the left of Fallout. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's good. I think I'm right there. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Because two of okay. you were indifferent about Fallout, but yeah. you were like not excited about. No, I wouldn't say indifferent. I say I'm, I'm also like it's it is on my list. I will watch it. I'm yeah. gonna make that priority. Okay. I'm Game probably Thrones, more excited yeah. for House of the Dragon season two than Fallout. Ooh. I'll be honest. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Just because I've seen the story already. You so know, I do want to see where it keeps going. Do we want to yeah. go Game of Thrones left to Fallout? Yeah. Let's do it. I mean, I just, I, I've read the book. Yeah, I, I did podcasts and you know, like oh after shows about oh, man. it. Yeah. yeah, I was like, you know, Game of Thrones has always been my jam, except. I don't want to talk about the last season of Game of Thrones. Oh, I was championing eight? it until the third episode. Oh, sorry. Oh, I know. Yeah. And then I, I remember <laughs> I, I, was, I was in London for a junket and I had uh -huh. to watch it on my phone. And oh, I no. sobbed. Oh. I sobbed. I cried so hard. I just felt so let down by the series. Anyway. Oh, man. We've got the penguin. Yeah, the penguin. penguin. I'll watch. Wham. I'll watch. I'll watch. There we yeah. go. Um, what? Colin Farrell was the best part of the Batman movie. Yeah. He was. He was in a very different movie than everyone else in that movie. Yeah. So I'd like to see what yeah. is unfiltered and unfettered by boundaries. I'm gonna put it to the. I would put it to the right of Kung Fu Panda exactly for where sure, I want it. Exactly for sure. And then what's to the right of that? Godzilla. That Kong. Godzilla? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'd put Penguin over Godzilla yeah. Kong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. yeah, yeah. Next, yeah. great. The Boys season oh, four. So I'm excited. So excited. I am so excited. bursting like a head <gasps> on a body. Oh, God. okay. Oh, yeah. I see. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 I, I mean, mean, bursting like a penis. That has a tiny, short, little, tiny miniature person in it, and then that person accidentally sneezes mm, and grows. There it is. That's what. No, no, I'm not that. I'm, but I'm so excited. I'm Don't so ever excited. be excited about that. Oof. You know that part was gross. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, so is it more? Are we more excited for it than Star Wars? I think so, only because I'm invested because I've seen every other season sure, and the other two sure, are sure. brand new properties. They're, they're, yeah, they're so I got okay. history. Yeah. All right, I'm good with that. Love it. I'm good with that. Someone's gonna have to tell me about this one. Ballerina. This is a John, John Wick spinoff. Yes. Sorry, Anna de Armas. Might forget about it. Oh, but Anna de Armas, I like her. But I might forget about it because I'm not a John yeah. Wick that, super fan. That, you, no. Anyone? Yeah. You, no one saw the Continental, right? No. Like no. Yeah. I did not see the other spinoff. I didn't yeah, see apparently the best John Wick, which was four, right? So I've heard mixed things. I've heard some people say it is, and other people say like, eh, it's maybe getting a little, a little stale. So I think maybe it's not a great like movie uh, overall. Yeah. It's very good, but, but all the four action is very good in form. Yeah, probably is maybe the best. But mm -hmm. I, yeah. I, I do like that. It's a, it's cool that it's a spinoff and it's about yeah. a woman character this time. Might and, forget and about Thomas it. is great, but I'm at might forget about yeah, it. Yeah, I just feel like that franchise is not having the sticking power it thinks it, it might have. Yeah, it's, so, it's exactly. Yeah. It's like I, I, John Wick was great. It's like, yeah. does it need to be a franchise? Yeah, probably know? right there, Dash. Yeah, I think. great. Re uh, no, I would put nah, I put ballerina to the left of Madam Webb. I don't okay, know about y'all. Okay. Thank you. Thank Ooh, you. Okay. Thank you. Wow, that was a That's where slight. I'm at. <laughs> yeah. We've got the next one, which is A Quiet Place I Day see. One Twilight. is what it's called. So I think this is a prequel of the ones that we've Yeah, I think seen. so. Yeah. So Might, forget about, yeah. Might yeah. forget about it. Yeah. I mean it. Look, I don't like horror. I don't mind these movies. Well, I know they're very well done. I've had I, to cover I agree them with for you. junket, so I was paid yep. to know. Yep. I yep. was yep. paid to know. But I don't mind how you know a lot of these horror movies and sci-fi horrors and stuff, they have like premises that sometimes are hard to like buy. Like I don't yeah. know if I buy that. And yeah. this one, the the quiet place world is very easy to pick apart if you mm -hmm. start going, Well, wait a minute. Well, if this, then what about this? But the movie, I think, is so well done that it's like, hush, 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 don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just, <laughs> yeah. just kind of like, yeah, you, you get the premise. You have to be quiet yeah. or the aliens are going to get you. Enjoy <laughs> it. And it's good. What and Emily thinking? Blunt's great in them. What are we thinking for this one? I'm going to say my forget about it because it's I not think a priority so. for me. Yeah, yeah. It's also it's not a priority for me as well. Okay, I can. Yeah. Uh, that's true. Yeah. And I'm like a bit indifferent. So Okay. 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 So, yeah. Uh, let's, let's, at the bottom? Uh, after Halo? Yeah, maybe. Shoot. Yeah, I'll probably watch okay. Halo before. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah, all right. There you go. All right. Twisters. What is, is, is it's a Twisters what I think it is? It's a remake of Twister. The oh. nine, was it 1995? <laughs> remake or sequel? Let's let's double check. With Mad About You's um, Helen Hunt. Helen Hunt. Wow. Helen Twisters. IMDb describes it as an update to the 1996 film Twister. 96. So uh, Twisters makes it sound like it's going to be a sequel. Like they're going to bring in somebody to, you know, like. So, 
I we in Australia we have a snack called a twisty, uh -huh. uh, which is kind of like your Cheetos here, but mm. like with better flavors. And <laughs> all right, um, uh, that just reminds me of that. And I would rather have a twisty than a twister. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so is this, is this a what is this again, or am I forget about it? Ooh. I think uh, you know what I mean. I would. I'm actually like cautiously excited about this. Okay. It's directed by the same director as Minari. Uh, it's okay, got Daisy okay. Anchor Jones, Anthony Ramos, great. Glenn Powell. It's, it feels like really like they're setting up something Anthony really Ramos. weird like here. Powell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so I don't know. Hottie. This this might be a, a this An is all watch. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'm, I'm happy to put in my forget about it. I'll, gi I'll give you all watch all the way to the right. Like the the, yeah. the least sure. priority. Yeah, I'll watch. yeah, yeah. I'll give you that. I, I will because you just listing a couple actors. I was and the director. Yeah. I was like, oh, yeah. I'll watch that. Yeah, like I'll watch Twister, the original, rewatch it because I don't remember anything about it. Actually, oh, I do remember dude. one thing about it, and then I'll watch Twisters. I've had to have this exact conversation so many <laughs> That's times. Fine. That's fine. <laughs> You know, Great. yeah. You're never really in the mood to see natural disaster films. Yeah, yeah, you know? that's also yeah. true, especially given the climate crisis. That's yeah, it. for sure. So maybe this movie will touch on that. Uh, the next one we've got Borderlands. Now again, this is a video oh. game adaptation. So yeah, let me and help it's, you and out it's here. live action. It has been in the makings for a while Years. now. I think it got pushed back because of um, the pandemic. Not the strike, like. Yeah. But the names in this one, Kate Blanchett mm -hmm. is in it. Drink. What? Australian. Whoa. Um. Uh, Jamie Lee Curtis is in this one. Oh my god. The Whoa. actual video game, it's going to have a very Mad Max feel if yeah. it's going to yeah. honor what the video games are all about. So it's post apocalyptic. Yeah. Um, it is a first person shooter, but it's got kind of RPG elements where it's like you can be different types of um, shooters in this. So you have different types of abilities. Mm -hmm. I, I would play this character, I believe her name was Maya. Um, she was like a healer by shooting some, like your own teammates, oh, you would sure. heal. Oh. Yeah. I am a big fan of the Borderlands. Games. games. So you. So where are you, you more so excited, excited for this than Fallout? I am more excited than this for than Fallout. Halo. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. Okay. More pumped for Fallout, um, only because yeah. I've seen it's like it's it's close. Yeah. And I can taste it. This is kind of like the Twisters effect for me. I mean, you yeah. you saying the actors like got me excited. Right. Yeah. What is what is the what is the blue thing again to the left of ballerina? It's uh it. it's a true detective. True detective. <laughs> true detective. I would put Borderlands to the right of True Detective, but to the left of Ballerina for might forget about it. No, you want to go higher than okay, Mod. You're looking at me like I mean, I, just I would definitely. I play, okay, I'm definitely gonna watch Borderlands before Rebel Moon Part Two. That's for okay. Sure. So it's the, so then it's in an all watch. Yeah, I think you so. You want to put Borderlands? Uh, it's just such an unknown for me so far, even with the cast that you were talking about, Mod. Do we have an image for it? Yeah, it's that right purple one. That no, but yeah. like, do we have like no anything nothing? I don't think anything's been entice. released yet. <laughs> it is very unknown. There's like a poster, right, or something. I'll give yeah, you this. I'll, like do, I'll do. I'll watch and put it to the left of Ghostbusters. Great. Yeah. Happy. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Next. Undeal. Forget it. Next. Alien Romulus. Okay, so I, I just saw it? Prometheus for the first time. Oh, cool. Oh. Yeah. I have that in 3D too. Should have come over. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay. What do you think of Prometheus? I. I mean, uh, Ridley Scott is in a really funny moment right now. <laughs> Napoleon. Yeah. Sucked. Napoleon was so bad. Napoleon that, was so bad. You know bad. what's so funny too is he, I, I really appreciate him as a filmmaker. I think he's I a too. fantastic yeah. director, yeah. and his work is very hit or miss. It with really me. is. Yeah. I think Thelma and Louise is a masterpiece. Yeah, I think Thelma and Louise is a masterpiece. I think that um, uh, I mean Ridley Scott he did Alien. Yeah. yeah, it's a masterpiece. But then yeah, Prometheus I'm like didn't work for me. But I appreciate. I didn't mind it. I appreciate a lot about it. Yeah, I do. I do. Mm -hmm. I, I just, love. I lo so we're talking about yeah. whether sci-fi is working or not. Yeah. I think Ridley Scott using the artist, what is it, like T, uh, someone? There's like the artistry. H.R. Geiger. H.R. Geiger. H.R. Geiger. Oh, yeah. Yes. Geiger. Oh, yeah, with all the so penis artwork. So he's got yeah. like, you know. Yeah, um, for sure. Like source material that he's that he's building it from, yeah. which mm -hmm. is when you learn about that, so fascinating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, I am kind of like I've I obviously watched like the original Alien movies, but I was very young and I was a bit scared yeah, and yeah. It broke my childhood somewhat. And now that I'm older, I'm like, yeah, Ripley, get away from me, you bitch. Um, that's great. I'm actually well, I'm that's, in. That's Aliens, isn't it, or is it the first that's one? That's Aliens. Yeah, I thought that's, that was the Cam that's James Cameron. Oh, that's James Cameron. Yeah. Again, yeah. he Cameron, he's, he, I like most of Cameron's stuff. Me too. <laughs> Avatar in here? No, that's not 2024. That's the year after. <laughs> no, yeah, uh, yeah. So um, I'm kind of like, I, I'm I, in so between all watching so excited. Yeah, and I think there's been a r interesting, like, like not reclaiming of, but like I think yeah. Prometheus is like starting to, like people are being friendlier on yes, it now. Yes, I agree. A little bit lighter and he, on it and over he did time. Covenant too, didn't he? Alien Covenant? I think Covenant? so, yeah. So, all yeah. right, I'll do, I'll do an all watch. Maybe yeah. I'm less excited than Kung Fu Panda. 
I'll do. Uh, yeah, that's where I'd put it. I'd mm, rather one I'd, ahead. One, one ahead, ahead of Kung Fu yeah, Panda. Yeah, one ahead. Yeah, put it one ahead. But yeah. Napoleon sucked. <laughs> so bad. It was so oh, bad. Oh man. Oh yeah. You know who was at that screening though? Name mm. drop. I have to. Mm. Dame Helen Mirren. Oh no way. At your yeah. Napoleon screening. Yeah. Huh. Did you ask her what she thought? Did, did no, she, she was like running towards the cheese yeah. canapé. Oh hell yeah. Was she yeah. Is she in the movie? No. Nah. Okay. Helen Mirren. One of the all-time greats, man. Yeah, one of the all-time greats. Next one, we've got Craven the Hunter. What is First this again? Day. No. First day. Yeah, Might forget Probably. about it. <laughs> what is this again? Might forget about it. Do we put it to the left of Madam Webb? Because they go together. Uh, Do we put it to the right of Madam Webb? I'm actually more excited for Madam Webb, just because it's so confound, okay. like okay. confusing to me. Then I'm happy with Craven <laughs> sitting on his throne there. How about that? Hold on, Craven's Marvel, yeah? Mm -hmm. well, well, what do you mean by that? Yeah. What, are you, what are you asking? I thought you'd be more excited if it was like even a Marvel yeah. adjacent thing. Craven the Hunter is my second favorite Spider-Man villain. That character is incredible. So? I am not excited about this movie. You, have you haven't seen that. Venom. You haven't seen Venom Let There Be Carnage. You haven't seen Morbius. Yeah, exactly. So that's yeah. where that goes. It's I didn't just, even it's know. It's just based off of that Sony live action track record. Got it's it. such a bummer, but yeah. But anyway, uh, Beetlejuice 2. Beetlejuice 2 with Michael Keaton? I'll watch it. <laughs> I'll watch it. I'm not. I'm also not a massive Beetlejuice original Beetlejuice fan. I so wasn't yeah. either. Love it. I, 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 I wa It did scare me, but I did watch it on a plane recently, and I was like, "This is Beetlejuice." Yeah, it's like, insane. This is what people. It yeah, this is what they reference. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Weird, right? It's wild. But Keaton is kind of like genius in that yeah, role. Yeah, yeah. He's come on, man. Come on. Yeah, <laughs> come on. He's, he's he's like on another level. He's yeah. next level. Beetlejuice so. influenced by June. Oh yeah, oh, well, yeah, that's yeah, right. the, yeah, that's right. So can you imagine Tim Burton's Dune? <laughs> How terrible that would be. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my Burton. goodness. All right, um, put it I, uh, the right of Twisters. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Sorry, yeah, and I know yeah, that Beetlejuice yeah, like it, yeah. is, yeah. it has a cult following. But I, let yeah. me see a trailer. Wanna, like, but let me see a trailer. We want to acknowledge yeah. that it does have a huge following. For sure. It was just a little bit out of our uh, viewing. Yeah. What is this next? I one? can't believe I included this one, and I can't cut any t full topic because they're all on the tier list. Oh my god! What um, is this next one? Transformers One is an animated Transformers film. Oh okay. Uh, what is this already? Uh, it seems. Uh, I watched Beast Wars as a kid. Like I, yeah. I loved the animated yeah. series yeah, when yeah, I was yeah. a kid. I just think that I have completely outgrown this 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 franchise. Did you see Bumblebee from a couple years ago? I didn't mind it. Yeah, I didn't really liked it. it. Did you see the one that came out this year, Transformers: Rise of the Beasts? One came out this year. Yeah, it did. No, I did know that. I saw the trailer for it, yeah. and I remember going, "Oh, I remember that as a kid." Yeah. Wasn't the ape in it? Yeah. So Beast. cool. So yeah. I'm more excited. Of what is it with me and Beast? <laughs> and he was voiced by, unless I'm mistaken. That is a therapy session uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. waiting to happen. I think it was Ron Perlman who voiced yeah. the, 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 in um, the show? The Optimus in, Primal or the, 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 the Gorilla yeah. Transformer. Optimus Primal. Which yeah. was like, this, this, the Transformers movie that came out this year was okay. Anthony Ramos, who was the lead in it, I thought did a really, really good yeah. job. Yeah. I want to see him do more stuff like that. I thought he was like basically just. You know, doing that same type of acting that Shia LaBeouf did in the yeah. first yeah. couple of movies, like which is not easy to do, and he was really charming in it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I think I, I Bumblebee is my favorite. But Transformers one, I'll put this in a, I'll give you a I'll might forget about might it. Forget about yeah, it. I mean, right. but but let me read off the cast because we're talking about celebrity Go ahead. Uh, voice actors. Yeah, Scarlett Johansson. What? Chris Hemsworth as Optimus Prime. Oh, I don't know about that. John Hamm as Sentinel Prime. Now that's making me. Le uh, John and Keegan Michael Key as Bumblebee. Oh, that he's gonna be great because oh. he did what he did with Toad. <laughs> and Brian Tyree Henry is Megatron. That's oh, cool. Interesting. That's cool. Brian Tyree Henry. Yeah, Man, from remember, Atlanta. Oh, sorry, from Megatron. Megatron. Sorry to name drop again. I remember one of my first carpets I ever did in LA was yeah. all the voice cast of um, Transformers, but like the oh. cartoons. Oh yeah. And it, I was it. Foot taller than all of those. Oh, men. absolutely. Peter Cullen is a normal sized man. He's a short man. Yes. Yeah. But his voice. I know. Maud Garrett. I know. And you're like, oh, hi. I was yeah. Like, How? So cool. <laughs> and he seems really nice. So, like, dude. What a cast, though. That's, yeah. That, that's it's wild. also wild that it's Hemsworth and not Peter Cullen. Yeah. I think. I'm not ready for that. Yeah. Man. I'm and not ready for that. And is there, dare I say it, with Mad Max and everything, is there too much Hemsworth happening? I mean, and there's going to be another Extraction 9 because of that contract that he signed. Oh, really? You yeah. know what I mean? I'm yeah. fine with that. I'm just like. <laughs> I, I want to put this now, and I might forget about it, but to the left of Rebel Moon. Yeah. To the left okay. of, like, Ooh, it's, okay. it's, it's on my radar, but it's, like, not a priority, yeah. but it's on my radar okay. now. Great. Well, we've got to punch through. Yeah, let's get going. Here. Okay. So, the Joker um, sequel, I mean. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, 
A Holy solid all watch. A solid all watch. A solid might forget about it and what is this again? I didn't like the first one. I did yeah. not either. It was very no. controversial. It was supposed to be controversial, but it did split yeah. the audience yeah. whether you liked it didn't or like not. It. And okay. I fell into the not camp. That's fair. Yeah. Where, where are we putting it then, Evan? Uh, might forget about it then? Might yeah. forget about it. We had two. Dashiell, dealer's choice. Put it wherever you want and might forget about it, my friend. All the way to the end. Okay. I like, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You Look said at that. what is See this that? again? Look at that. What's that? What? That's fine. Okay. Okay. Uh, Venom three. <laughs> oh no. Uh, oh. Might forget about it. We're gonna put it to the left of Madam Web. Done. Yeah. You haven't seen any of the Venoms. Nope. I got the first one in three D. Come over. We'll watch it. Uh, you know what it is? The yeah. only Venom I ever had was Topher Grace, and I just yeah. did not need any of that ever again. Sure. Oh, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Uh, uh, he had that's sharp weird. teeth. That's <laughs> weird. Yeah. All I right. Guess. Gladiator two. This now, is real. Who was the star of this one? Paul Mescal. See, did you see normal people on Hulu? If yeah. you haven't and you want an emotional, heart-wrenching show, mm -hmm. he's fantastic. I think he's an actor to watch big time. Yeah, okay. After Sun. Australia's After very Sun very own. After Pro. Burn? Drink, please. Okay. After Sun. It's called After Sun? Yeah. My goodness, I'm out of drink, otherwise I would. Is ah. there an Australian actor this Well, time? technically Russell Crowe's Kiwi, yeah. but if he throws a phone, he's from New Zealand. If he does Gladiator, <laughs> he's from Australia. Gladiator 2, I'll do it in I'll Watch. I'll, I'll watch. watch. Yeah. Put it after before, Kung Fu Panda 4, for yeah. sure. Before Twister. Thank before you. Twister, yeah. After, uh, before Ghostbusters. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, Wicked. Wicked part oh, one. one. So excited for this one. So excited. So excited. Ariana Grande as yeah. Glinda, the Glinda yeah. the Good Witch. Mm -hmm. And some other folks. And from the director of uh, In the Heights, right? Yes. Wasn't it, is it uh, John, John M. Chu? Yeah, John M. Chu. It did yeah. uh, uh, crazy, uh, crazy Rich Asians. Like, mm -hmm. great director. I'm excited yeah. about that. I, I rewatched the original Wizard of Oz. I've, I've been on a Wizard of Oz kick recently oh, and watching nice. those what films. Oh, yeah. it It's really fun. Um, I saw for the first time Oz the Great and Powerful with James Franco. <laughs> really bad. Yeah. Really bad movie. But Wicked, I'm excited because yeah. I have not seen the musical. I don't know the music. I don't know. I've never experienced it, so I'm going to experience it for the first time as yeah. well. Yeah, I just got the, that one song, Defying Gravity. Are we That's doing so excited, so excited for this one? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Where are you at? No? At the end of So Excited. That's fine. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm just That's not fine. a, I'm, believe it's it or fine. not, I'm not a musicals girl. Mm, okay. Yeah. okay. Uh, but Jonathan Bailey, is that his name? He was in um, Bridgerton season one. Oh, is he a uh, kid? Okay. Yes. Okay. He's very much not on my playing field. Oh, okay. He Why likes men. Oh, okay. I was like, I was like, Maude, how dare you? You're in everyone's playing field. No, it's okay, except yeah, for yeah. gay men. Got it, got it, got it, yeah. got it. Yeah, for sure. But for sure, I'm for sure. really excited to see him. Again, I think he's enough, like, he's Great. a star to watch. Yeah. Um, so I'm excited about that. But a little tea, even though we don't have time for this, Ariana Grande broke up a marriage on this movie. Oh, well, yeah, she did. Gosh. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Good Game Season 2. No, we we oh, two. Karate Kid. Is this happening in 2024? Allegedly. I mean, I doubt it now. They're casting. They're I'll actively watch it. casting I'll right watch now. it. Did you watch the last one? Uh, with Jackie Chan? With yeah. With you. are talking about the TV show Cobra Kai. No. Nope, oh, you're talking about Jackie Cobra Chan Kai. and uh, Jaden Smith. Jaden Smith. Yeah. I, did mm -hmm. not, uh, I did not. I'm interested in seeing what it was good. They'll keep doing with yeah. this as a series, a franchise. It's yeah. really interesting that it's so taken off the way it has. I'll yeah. put it all the way to the right of Beatrice yeah. too. It's fine. Not, yeah, yeah. Not, yeah. Not okay. Much of a priority. <laughs> okay. Just, I still haven't I like seen that. Cobra Kai, and people love Cobra Kai. I've heard amazing things about Cobra Kai. Yes. So I. That's my priority. I'm going to watch that. Celebrities that I've loved. After meeting them, yeah. even more, Jackie yeah. Chan. Oh, great. Mm. Interesting. Very the nice. Best. That's yeah. great. The best. That's great. He's so great. Okay, next. Netflix's Squid Game season two. Might forget about it. Forget about it. Isn't this interesting? Because the first season basically bankrolled Netflix. I yeah. Know, for, it was yeah. the most Huge. watched. I, it doesn't Huge. need a season two. I don't want it to have a season there two. There you go. I watched three episodes and fell off. Oh, what? I Why? Know. You were bored? I just didn't. I mean, I don't really have like... Um, Desires to watch people get killed. Right. Yeah. For sure. For sure. I thought that's. What, like I, I know you. That's fair. You know I, mean? I know you. It's, it's, pretty, it's pretty bleak. It's but like, it's yeah. like murder porn in a way. So I would say yeah. I might forget about it. I'll put it after uh, ballerina. Yeah. The, straight in the middle of the pack. Yeah. Let's straight do it. in the middle of the pack. Again, if you loved it, fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Your list might look very different great, to great. the list yeah. that we've got. Yeah. It is strictly viewing pleasures here. Yeah. Our last few here. Stranger Things, the final season. So, final season. Uh, final I'll season. I'll watch. I'm at I'll watch. I've seen the other four seasons. I'm a strong I'll watch. Yeah. yeah, yeah I yeah, am yeah, invested yeah, yeah. in this. Yeah. Let's I do go. think they should have wrapped it up after the season that they've just done I, and I, they I are agree. stretching it out. I think the kids are just as over it as we're starting I to think get so over too. it. Let's go after Fallout before X-Men. I like that one. Yeah. After Fallout it. before X-Men. But Next at the same up. time, I love their storytelling. I think they do a really good Yeah. And the music's the best. Mr. and Mrs. Smith. I will uh, say I oh. loved the original. It is Might Donald. Forget about it. it is Donald uh, Glover. 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 Yeah. Uh, Maya Erskine. Thank yeah, you. From yeah. From Pen Fifteen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I am 
not excited about I this. Oh, no. I haven't seen I, it's a I, movie I know, TV show. Movie? It's a TV show. It's a TV show. I, I, I know I've said I've been bursting for a few oh, of these very jokingly, fine. but I am bursting for this. this okay. Looks, I love I'll that for you. you. I love we'll that for you. We'll compromise. We're going to go put it at All Watch. We're going to yeah. put it at the end of All Watch. Okay. Yeah, yeah. After whatever that it's last thing there is. Yeah. There we go. That Another funny. movie that the original broke up a marriage. Oh, oh yeah. Sorry, I'm an entertainment reporter. That's true. That's, I, yeah. I was like, did someone That's break true. up a marriage during this? Committed to memory. That's true. Yeah. The next we've got Ooh. The Lord of the Rings, The War of the Rohirrim. Yep, you have to say it's like going to be the first Lord of the Rings movie in a long time. Animated, and from like an anime studio too, isn't it? Isn't it like? Isn't it be mm. like animated overseas? I, I'm yeah. super excited about Interesting. this. Interesting. Okay. I'm going to say so excited. I'll Do you say know so what excited. Happened? The Lord of the Rings yeah. show had yeah. so much hype; it overpromised and underdelivered yeah. that it's kind of tarnished Prime having their grubby hands. I think on so. is this Prime or is this something else? Is this it? is a uh, new line in Warner Brothers Animation. Oh, so they're fighting so the, over so it. So the, they I mean, split up the Tolkien yeah, properties. Yeah, because Tolkien has their stuff. Yeah, that's the other thing. That, okay, then that, I'm a little bit more excited about it. I'll watch it. It's not from Amazon Studios or whatever. It's mm -hmm. supposed to be a different group of people. But that, but to, to your point, though, Maude, honestly, just talking about the franchise as a whole, it does kind of bother me that there isn't that they're not going like all in. With yeah. one, you know that they that they gave uh, Amazon the rights to like the fringes and the indexes mm. of the Lord yeah, of the Rings yeah. books, but not the Cimmerillion. Yeah. So they couldn't in Rings of Power do some things, but they could do some things. And I'm like, yeah. that that bugs the hell out of me. I will Why say, that? that's weird. Fantastic properties get hurt the most when studios and greed play a role in it. And they're Sony. They're Sony they're for you. Sony. Boom. Yeah. So it. I'm going to put this at so excited just because of the potential, but you guys can put it in I'll watch if I'm you want. I'll or watch my for this one. I'll yeah, watch. I'll okay. watch. Okay, we're uh, at. Before X-Men? After X-Men? After uh, X-Men. After X-Men. Okay, yeah. before Avatar? Uh, yeah. 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 Okay. That feels good. Great. Feels this is just good. a movie. I'll probably click play on this faster than I will click play on, on Avatar. There yeah. you go. And the last one is Sonic the Hedgehog 3. My forget about. First thing. <laughs> Might forget about. Might forget about. No, Shadow the Hedgehog. I, I feel about. really bad. Oh yeah, Shadow the Hedgehog is in this. Shadow the Hedgehog is in this. Oh, is this with I Idris Elba? No, Idris Elba is is he not already did Knuckles. Yeah, he did it. He already right. did but that he'll be back. I'm so sure. I I watched the first one. Yeah. It was a junket. Yeah. yeah. I was so violently hungover. It's ruined Sonic for me. <laughs> oh <laughs> no, uh, my. Oh You didn't no. think we were gonna bring personal stories into this new rock stars audience? Well, guess think what? Again. We have guess no choice. Why? That's oh, part of it. But I will say that the interview I had with Jim Carrey. That's why I challenged him to a face off <gasps> after like eight years, and he finally was able oh, to do the wow. one thing that he couldn't do go. before. Yeah. That's Nicely done. Jim Carrey. So this is, is he going to be in it? Bursting with excitement. I don't know if Eggman. Um, I think he survived. Yeah, I, I can't Dr. remember Robotnik. where he ends in the second one. I mean, I, I imagine. Seen the second one yet. I imagine I he's in this though. Yeah. I like what is it Ben Schwartz? Ben Schwartz. Yes. I like what he's, he's good done Sonic. with the yeah, Sonic. He's fine. And the story behind that is he did the scratch voice for it, and they kept going back to him, and they're like, "We're not finding a celebrity voice that can do." And I'm like, that's what you should be doing. Yeah. So I do appreciate it. That's even what though, I'm hoping for yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> even though he is a celebrity voice actor who yeah. did it, it's, it's it, it, yeah, they were going with that. Oh, yeah, versus... he's in the Huey, Dewey, Louie animated series. Yeah, that's right. That DuckTales yeah. is what it's called. Yeah. All <laughs> right. Huey, Dewey, Louie animated series. I'll there watch. There it is. Uh, uh, that's in an all watch? Sonic 3's all watch no. for you? No, might forget I mean, about I'm, it. I'm compromising with you guys. Okay. okay. Top of my forget about it. End end of, you were bursting. I'll give you end of all watch. I will give you end of all watch. Okay. I would rather wow. watch End of Watch. I'll watch it on a plane also hungover. Yeah. We did it. Don't watch End of Watch on a plane. Wait, we didn't do it. We, we, I oh, want to yeah. throw one in there. I want to throw one in there. Dasho, if you can grab Star Trek Discovery Season 5. <laughs> last season. Season last 5. Last season. Bring it on home. I'm so excited with this. I might be bursting with excitement with this. I'm also really sad because it was canceled and they made this season and they didn't know it was going to be the end, which is a real bummer. Oh, so, so just like everyone else, I might forget about that. Oh, oh no. that's brutal. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's brutal. Star um, Trek's in a weird place right now. I wish the best for the franchise. There's been a lot of nostalgia recently. They've, you know, they've, they've, they've experimented with do doing some newer stuff. I want them to do both. I want them to be able to do the stuff that that uh, sort of like fans with established things really, really like. And then I want them to be able to do weird and crazy. Mm. And season four of Discovery is really good, and it's mm. out there, dude. It's like a, it's like a Ridley Scott. It's like oh. a, you know, there's some, wow. there's some fun sort of high concept. Thank you um sci-fi in it so i will i, I want to compromise and i'm gonna give you guys an i'll watch yep is that sure. cool yeah. yes can Done we put deal. it after creature commandos but before borderlands <laughs> no what no? put it after twister after twisters, after twisters. <laughs> brutal oh dashel okay. that sucks yeah. 
Oh, man. You guys are all haters. You guys say you guys are part of the problem. You it's really hard when it's season it's five. Yeah, sure. that's true. And you haven't seen season one through four? That's Do you true. have anything yeah, yeah, yeah. you want to add for next year that you're excited about that we didn't cover in this oh, exhaustive list? Put me on the spot. I, I mean, I have something for what sure. What is it? What? I'm excited that Disney's going to re-release oh, yeah. Luca, uh, Turning Red, and Soul. and Soul in theaters. Yes. Oh, I think that's really cool that th yeah. that's happening next year. Those animated movies deserve like a chance to be seen on the big screen. I I'm going to go try, I'm gonna go try yeah. to make it. My only thing is I'm really... Crossing my fingers, I'm hoping they have 3D screenings of these movies oh. because they were released at home over the pandemic. Yeah. And Soul, and I think even maybe Turning Red, because that they, they were released on Disney Plus in the U.S., Disney mm -hmm. Plus wasn't in other territories around the world, so they got limited theatrical releases. And Soul oh. has a 3D version that oh, Pixar wow. did make. Yeah. Nobody in the U.S. ever saw it in the theater. Nobody in Whoa. the U.S. ever saw well, it at it's home. There. It's already there. Put it yeah, in theaters. I'll go, right, yeah. I'll go right now. I just saw Wish in 3D. Come on, Disney. I'll go right now. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. I want to see Luca. Silencio yeah. Bruno in 3D. Yeah. Come on. Silencio <laughs> Bruno. Um, I know. Wrap it up? We absolutely should. <laughs> you haven't seen Luca, have you? Nope. <laughs> I've heard the soundbite on TikTok. Ooh. Okay. Um, we'd love to hear your thoughts on all of these things. You can either individually rank them all in the comments. You can agree or disagree with us. There's you no know, wrong opinion. And I, what I would love to, if, if ranking all of it is too much, at least hit us with your bursting with excitement. Yeah. Your what top are, five. Yeah. Right. What is in your bursting with excitement category? List everything that's in your bursting with excitement. That would be cool to read and yeah. how do you burst with excitement i feel like i gave some examples earlier like with um that's all i just want to know you break out in a sweat this is how i do it ah! Yay! <laughs> Yay! the atomic breath just shoots yeah, yeah, out yeah. there but that is it from us today thank you so much for joining us and for listening to us break it all down right here on The Break Room. Make sure you subscribe to the channel on YouTube. We really want to get that at least a 70. Sweet, sweet 70 would be nice. You can make <laughs> sweet that, 70. You can make that happen. Also follow us on Twitch. We'll do these videos live. We've got some fun emotes. If you want to be a part of all of our in-jokes like Fleshy, that's where you'll get all of that. <laughs> follow us on show, socials as well. Break Room's going to do some fun things. It's Break Room NR mm -hmm. on you. Instagram, on Twitter, or X, whatever you want to call it, and on threads. Thank you again for my palace for giving opinions as well. Appreciate everyone. Thank you, Mom. We're, that's it. That's it. That's it. Bye. <laughs> Great. Solid ending. Solid, Solid ending. ending.